should be okay. Let's wait for normal people to come by. Start of the stream, we gotta try and take down Rajang again. Want to get that sword upgrade. HRK hello, Sphoney hello, Fire Cannon hello, Oz hello, Devastation hello, Chaos hello. Chili Cheese Tater Tots got me feeling uh, a little something special, guys. Chaos Dragon hello. That was... That was something. You really want chili cheese tater tots? You got an air fryer? Yeah, I mean, the air fryer is nice. You know, it's it's convenient. Okay, now burst hello. Shop hello. Bandstand hello. Has it been long? I bet it's only been a couple days. I don't believe you. It can't have been that long. Gator hello. Fume hello. You almost beat Demo Mall today. What weapon? Am I 3065 yet? Imagine if you actually lived 3,000 years. Caladram, right on time. Siphonia. Has it been a couple weeks? I don't believe you. Ryx. Hammer? Dude, I like first tried out of the gate, no warm up, took out Maldo. Now, to be fair, the ending was kind of like I was hacking. It felt like I was hacking because, like, he couldn't figure out how to get out the door. I've never seen anything like it. He, like, got stuck. The bomb dunk was impressive. Thank you. I, I live to entertain. It's, it's my, my little... My life is to be a clown. And if I can bring you joy, then that's a good thing. It was fun. It was good. It was a good. It was a good stream. It was an all right stream. Pre-recorded, confirmed. If I was watching me, I would be like, "That guy pre-recorded that." <laughs> I'd be like, "There's no way. There's no way." But I mean, I had. I mean, everything was there. I mean, I had the. I even had controller inputs being read. Suzenko, hello. I'm going to allow that. Lux Arcadia, hello. So yeah, we need to be Rajang. You know, I think we're going to do the double arena Rajang first. I think that's what we're going to do. Kinezis, hello. Sometimes it's as if the hunts get handed to you. Is that like Matrix quote? You know, when, you, when you're really part of it, you won't even have to try or something like that. That's the way it felt. It's like you don't even have to try. They just, get, they just, they just hand it over. Show us the folder? Yeah. Yeah, I believe it. Uh, we'll probably switch over to World tomorrow. Switch over to world. Do the Ibushi event. Nah. Not going to do it. My uh, switch is downstairs. It is... Oh. It is for use of um, playing Rune Factory 4 only. The real world? No. <laughs> not, the, not the real world. Abushi event? I mean, I'm not surprised that there's an Abushi event. You guys think we're going to get all the events at once when Rise hits PC? Or do you think they're going to stagger it out? Time Factory 4? Dude, you lose so much time when you play that game. Your mom uses the Switch as a YouTube machine? I didn't know there was a YouTube app on Switch. 
Did I order the popcorn flavor shakers yet? I didn't. I probably should, though. What set am I using now? Sharpness plus one, razor sharp. Uh, I mean, it's reckless abandon three, but you would you would know it as critical eye plus three. Betting on staggered lead at the sunbreak. I don't know that there's enough time though. Like, is there enough time? They, they might have to do a dump. So uh, let's get some more flashbacks. Nah, time, time factory is, is accurate, but it's it's a fun way to spend your time. I recommend it. $30 on the Switch. Not not really a bad price. And that's full price. It might go on sale sometimes, too. Who's going to play Mo Metroid, but it's not Monster Hunter, you know? Oh, I know. <laughs> we were talking about that earlier on stream today. Someone's like, streamer, do you ever get tired of Monster Hunter? And it's like, it's like somebody who's like addicted to a drug. And it's like, well, I wish there were other games out there as good as this game. I don't sound like a hipster, but it's just not. So, like, Volcano Burst, like, looking at it, like, if you look at, like, screenshots and stuff and videos, it might look kind of crusty because it's based off of a 3DS game. And it, it absolutely has, like, a little bit of crust on it, but it plays and it runs great. So, in that regard, I could, I could really recommend it. You know, you can tell it's like one of those games. It's like the Switch is a really underpowered piece of hardware, but it's going off of the 3DS, which is an even more underpowered piece of hardware. So it ends up being great. Looking forward to five? Uh, I am now. <laughs> I mean, I'll probably be a little Rune Factoried out by the time five comes out, but I'm very happy it's coming out. They took the time to in include, uh, actually add same-sex marriages, and that's really neat. I like that. Turn up, hello. Punch me, daddy. I mean, they, I mean, they went and they re-recorded or, or made new CGI or, or anime cutscenes and everything. Now they really, I mean, I want to be like, oh, they went above and beyond, but like they really did it. So. <laughs> In Harvest Moon, you could be same-sex best friends. I mean, that's something. Texas! I forgive you, Texas. Let me ask you something. If you had a best friend in Harvest Moon, could you and your best friend have a baby together? Take a second to remake this. Texas will always betray me. I mean, I love him anyway. Well, so Silver Die Wolf, uh, Rajing and Blaganga were added at the same time. They were both added in dose, but apparently uh, Rajing was added later. And the rumors are that Takuda, like, basically took the time to make him. The goddess gifts you a child? That's kind of...
Yeah, no, we were, we were, I was talking earlier about how much I enjoyed Rajang. Such a cool monster. Nice! Perfect. Just need to get the spirit gauge up a little bit more. Set it back, huh? One more hit, maybe? This, oh, I might die here. This is going amazing, by the way. We are we are kicking little monkey's ass. Walter, thank you. 19 months? Doesn't feel like 19 months. I honestly feel like I just started. Oh, you know what today is? Holy crap. This is the third year anniversary of me streaming full time. Literally on this day, October 13th, 2018. I decided, like, eh, let's give it a shot. How cool is that? This is it. It doesn't feel like, at some time, in some ways it feels like a million years, and in some ways it doesn't feel like any time at all. It was yesterday? It's the 14th? I know, I'm saying it's the 14th. The 14th is it, October 14th, 2018. All right, let's not lose focus though on this Roger as he rams me. It took me three years to get the 3066. That's actually not bad. The 13th? Oh, the 13th, oh, oh I'm, I'm, I lied to you. The 13th is another day. The 14th is the stream of virtue. What is the 3066 thing? It's my Twitch power level. God, stop running, buddy. Miss Dumpy YouTube streams? The, the only thing that was dumpy was the actual stream content itself. The streaming platform was amazing. Daddy's here. How long did it take? Seven minutes? Oh, I'm not, I'm not going for the horns at all. I'm going for fangs, and I hope I get them, but... There it is. Literally have everything we need. Uh... Yes, we need fangs for the, uh... The long sword. I like how he comes in already angry. How come it takes me the entire time to beat a rainy, but it takes me seven minutes? You mean Raja? I don't know. He let me car for that long? Well, that's why I spammed him with um, a flash bomb.
Definitely getting better at G rank Rajay. <laughs> I will say that much. Oh, traps are like instant in Rise. It's ridiculous. I take some issue with it, but whatever. I'm not going to cry about it. I don't want to get him. I don't want to get him with a pitfall trap if I can. That was a very short punch. He's so large, his head is pushing me away sometimes. That's funny. <laughs> Am I giving a rating for each hunt that's on my spreadsheet? No, I don't have a I don't have like a rating system yet. I probably should though. The worst hunt was um G rank Rathalos in the old volcano by far. Why am I using the skull helm? It's so powerful. Remember, we win even if we lose. So I I I'm satisfied with with where we are right now. I'm not too worried, though. Oh, it is ugly. Oh, it's awful. I hate the Skull Helm. I hate it so much. No, I don't really want to use it, but... Oof. Oof. Running slow. I know I'm running slow. This, uh, Spirit Blade have Mind Eye in the version. Yes. It does. You actually get a sharpness boost by just filling up your Spirit Gauge the whole way. the way his beam looks. I know some people say they think it looks like dumpy, but I, I think it's great. What the hell was that? That was kind of weird, right? No. is bad. It shows mercy. Oh. It's okay. It's still okay. I knew that was like a little greedy. Was I playing the demo borderless or full screen? I was playing it in uh, borderless full screen. Am I throwing? It doesn't matter. I already have everything I need for the upgrade. The only reason to keep going is to make sure I've got extra parts to maybe even be able to get the hammer upgrade as well.
100% throwing, by the way. See, like, fighting the close to the walls is really dangerous. It's like he can get stuck on them. It's like all the skill you had disappeared after that pitfall went down. Well, the larger they are, the harder they are. How much uh, cheap burger meat and cheap white bread did I go through before the pineapple story? It was a lot. I mean, it's all I ate for three days. I mean, it would have been at least nine burgers, but probably closer to 15 to 18. I was probably eating two burgers a meal. For like three or four days. Three meals a day. Yeah, I mean, what do you think that does? You know the pineapple story. This is a little annoying. What are you even going for? I feel like his AI is broken. Stop. How's the monkey hunting going? Uh, really good, actually. Even if we die, we've already won. Get him, Texas. It's a large uh, Rajang. He's not necessarily a fixed size, but he's always of a certain large size. I don't know, maybe he is fixed. In this quest, there's Big Monkey and there's Little Monkey. This is the Big Monkey. I mean, it, it's possible. I mean, I guess it's possible he's a fixed size, right? I'm so scared right now. I wanna... <laughs> it doesn't matter. We're fine. It's okay. That's not copium either. He had to be under 50%. I'm great at those kind of reactions. Uh-huh. His right in Freedom Unite? I guess. Depends how far away you are from him. Well, look, we got it, okay? We're good. I only need 115,000 Zenny. It's hard to even call it a move, right? It's just like a thing that he does. He just does it. like scuttling through all of my old rewards trying to make ends meet <laughs> I 
This is so undignified. Like the person like standing in line, like digging through all their pockets and bags, trying to find change to pay for like a loaf of bread. Hold on. Hold on, I know I had it. Hold on. I know it's in here somewhere. It's only 36 people in the two-player leaderboards for the new boss. Trying to wrestle together a team? Take them. I like that monkey game. I want to sell my power seeds. Not really, but there we go. So you actually lose affinity here. But then if I put this back on, it comes back. Remember the tiny dinosaurs laughing at me in Crash 4? Yes, I remember. I remember the tiny dinosaurs. Oh, yeah, I mean in Rise, they expect you to be in the mines pretty much consistently. Lux, this is Monster Hunt. This is second gen. I'm not sure if you're talking to me, though. Okay. The honey. The honey drip is starting to be a bit of an issue, too. Oh, God. We're almost out of God bugs. This is like never ending. All right. Urgent quests. What do we got here? Am I thrilled to do the mining runs in PC? I mean, I can at least, I mean, I could do those off stream. At least we know how to do them. Use the white hammer for God bugs. Is it worth it? Yeah, I know she sells it, but I'm I'm kind of broke. If you hadn't noticed. Gold Rathian. That sucks. I think it's her wings. How do you deal with mastering farming world? Just do the guiding lands. You need to do it anyways. How was dinner? I made chili cheese tater tots and they were even better than I thought they would be. Turns out if you don't cart, you don't have a lock, lack of money. What the hell are you trying to say? Sounds amazing. It was great. I mean, I, I want to say it's homemade. I mean, it's not, but it's not like I like handmade the tots. I just air fried them out of a bag, but they were good. Much, even better than I would have ever expected. Can I give us the recipe for tots? Air fry your tots. Heat up two cans of generic all meat chili. Put the chili in a, in a casserole dish. Put the tots on top once they're really crispy. Then you put some cheese on and you put it under the broiler for like, I don't know, six or seven minutes. Two Black Diablos? I'm not doing that right now. I'm not I'm not at a place. M mentally or emotionally. The funny thing is, like, I spent all this time upgrading this weapon, but honestly, like, I'm gonna have to make a gun for those guys. We might actually go back and, like, make, like, Sienatar gun or something like that. I don't know. 
Add more cheese, add bacon. Bacon would have been okay, but I don't know that it needed the extra calories. Oh, oops. I didn't even eat. Let alone bring <laughs> max potions. Make the Lao Cannon? I don't know that I need some... I mean, Pellet would be perfect on the Diablos, but anything kind of works on them. What I really need stuff is for the Gravios. The Tigrix tank? I did get the... Um, like a Heavenly. I do need an Azure Lao kill, but that's like a high rank Azure Lao we're going to be doing. My throne of lies is collapsing around me. I'm kind of like, no. Everything is wearing out. I mean, I know. I, I, I promise you, I do, ne do not need rapid pellet. Pellet is like such a gimmick shot. It's, it's just really for the Diablos. Kieran. So I'm pretty sure she's weakest in the wings. She look kind of small, you guys. She doesn't look big for a while. Oh, Narga Kuga would be great. Well, I think we got a Narga Heavenly, didn't we? That was bad. That came out. She's not even enraged. Old P. Rathian. This is probably why she's mad. You guys are calling her Old P. Rathian. So, unenraged, she can flip twice. Good to know. That's almost definitely going to be a double flip, right? Dodge is on point. Good work. The dodging is very difficult in this game. So thank you. doing a lot of overhead shops. We are going to get this tail. Baza, hello. Good. 
<laughs> uh, I would say Bracky is a lot harder Somnus than Tigrix. Because Tigrix, like, as long as you don't die, he gets tired and he's so easy. find yourself in one of those do or die situations where you have to evade <laughs> that's scary I don't like it when that happens that's stressful I just want a baby game is this monster Hunter one this is monster hunter freedom unite portable second G second generation PSP game Put on the baby blanket? You know, now that you, you say it like that, Trey Dog, it's kind of like Temporal Mantle's the baby blanket, and then the Mega Potion's like the, uh, the baby bottle. Does that analogy work? I think it does. Rigsy, thank you. Oh, a, a bonus subscription? Mega Potions the Sippy Cup? Honestly, the, even the Mega Potion is like... Or the, the normal potion is pretty good in that game. You'll be able to beat Magnum Aldo ZMTL a couple couple attempts and you'll have it. Wonder one cap Hamel Weenus from the bottle? Never. I've got I'm I'm optimistic about Sunbreak. If they got the demo director on the case, it should be pretty fun. Woo! Mizu sub 15 with one cart. I mean, honestly, I've got a ton of experience, and I think that's actually what I did today, so... But then again, I only did one easy, so. Are the legs fine? I know they're better than the head for cutting. You don't like soda? Uh, I love soda. I just don't drink it. Demo weapons are bad. Your biggest hit with Insect Lave is 35. Is that really Tornado Slash? No way. They're the second best zone after the wings. Okay. Thank you. Ooh. Alright, that's rude. Can we agree on that being rude? Do I like fizzy flavored water? I like lots of things, but I pretty much, just so I keep good habits, drink pretty much exclusively water or water with electrolytes in it, and that's it.
I mean, don't get me wrong, I'd suck down a whole milkshake if I thought I could get away with it. I just, you know, my body will retain literally any calorie you give it, so... I have to be a little careful from time to time. Here we come again! <laughs> How's my Rune Factory adventure going? Pretty good. Uh, I make sure to sleep and bathe regularly. <laughs> just like in real life, actually. I can get away with it. Sock Mom with you? Thank you. It's pretty nice. Uh, I enjoy the game turn up because the way the challenge works out, I could kill pretty much everything, but then they can also kill me very easily. Which is kind of like how I like the difficulty to be in my games. Do I remember to eat dishes though? I eat all the time. My eating is very good as well. Phew, I got the recipe for popcorn? My cooking, my cooking skill is like level 55. And I'm like in like the first week of summer, so. When am I done with this game? We should be done by this time next week. Please. Wow, I'm so glad I cut her tail. I spent a lot of time running the store just to maximize my profits. That's a lot of fun. I should probably sharpen for them. Setting a new rig, love getting a new PC. Level cooking in real life? No, 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 not in real life. In, in Rune Factory 4. My cooking is okay in real life. I, I don't claim to be the world's best cook, but like I try. That feels bad. Any, growing any interesting summer crops? Well, not any actual pineapples, but uh, I just planted some apple trees. I did an actual entire field of yams for you. God, my power level is increasing every day, guys. Every day it goes up higher. Can you imagine? What if Goku just kept going up into Super Saiyan levels and he never went down? God damn it. Shut up, Rath. Rathian, you're, 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 you're ruining my point. Yams are very useful, yeah. I think I got a recipe for, like, the yam of yams? Isn't that basis for Dragon Ball Z? Like, what, is, what if he's, like, every time he wanted to go Super Saiyan, he just kept going up in levels? Goku would have to eat and drink sometimes? That's true. That's where my yams come into play. I looked at the yam wand and I'm like, I don't want to make that. But I do have the recipe for it. Is that what KO can is for? I guess. What does this guy say about Dreamer's Twitch ranking? Almost under 300? Hey, that's an upgrade, dude. I'll take 300. 300 maybe would be too bougie, though. Well, they're actually useful, though, Fume. I found one. No spoilers. That's like... Uh, a weapon? And it helps me level up my weapons. My weapon crafting score. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think that they're, they're good for your, your smithing and stuff. It's a fun game. I, I like learning mechanics and stuff like that in games. Like, I actually enjoy that more than the actual games sometimes. I don't know if anyone else feels that way. Or if I'm just like a big weirdo. Ow! Alright. 
Let's wait. Wait for a moment. We'll eat our meat. Why am I already down? It's been 15 minutes already. All right. Well. Just when I was getting ready to get back into the fight. I got sloppy. Waste of a steak? Oh, I've got so much, though. Because I've been using the uh, steak thing to, like, level up my, my cats, my cooking cats. You want to be a wasp? You want to be a mindless drone that attacks things for no reason? That sounds terrible. Flying would be kind of neat. But there's so many better insects out there. Oh no. Yeah, I hit the wing at least. Wasps don't have to live in capitalism? It's true. They, they kind of just like live in their own society. What if flying felt like a full-blown sprint every time you did it? That would be very uncomfortable. Why does my longsword feel so micro sometimes? No! All right, we're gonna take our max potion now. Dude, I knew that was a possibility too. Why did I do that? <sighs> My long sword is not micro. Feels micro. What do you think, Texas? I mean, we're doing so good for so long. Switch Axe? Switch Axe, unfortunately, is not in this game. Second gen Switch Axe is locked to Frontier. Super Star, I don't know if you heard it at all, but they're apparently creating a single player version of Dragon Quest X in Japan. They've got no public plans to release it. Oh my god, Texas, you're such a chad. Julian Carter, hello. How goes your evening? Are you feeling better? Didn't you say you were... Was it last night your night off, or were you sick? Gordon Kakoto, hello. Looks post-apocalyptic. I mean, the tower is definitely the remains of some sort of advanced civilization. Spring the 18th, that's pretty cool for you. Have you ever considered actually like trying to do a run? Yeah, so, like I said, Super Soul, apparently it's only up until the first expansion. It's only in Japanese, but hey, I mean, that's a start, right?
It reminds you of Shadow of the Colossus? I get it. The lighting and the color scheme kind of is like Shadow of the Colossus, isn't it? you always wanted dragon quest 10 i mean like i said there's a chance you'll be able to experience at least part of the story someday it's definitely not going to be the whole thing somebody invited you to play castlevania harmony of despair i have a pretty like decent fume character on that oddly enough whatever the guy's name is i think it's fume the ninja guy? Like the pixel guy? I mean, they're all kind of pixel people, but you know what I mean. On Xbox? No, nah, it was PlayStation 3. I'm sorry. I probably could have carried you, though, if I remembered how to play the game. I, I think I got some pretty good equipment in it. I played it quite a bit. It was one of the last really creative games Konami put out. Why not all of it? It's too much game, Super Sorrow. And they're, they're changing up a number of the mechanics in it as well from what it looks like. Did I not carve the tail? I don't think I carved the tail. It's free with Xbox Live Gold right now. I'll probably buy it. Maybe I will play it with you. I have to start a new character, but that's fine. All right. So, all right. Let's 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 talk this out together, everyone. I need to do. I can't talk it with people if running an ad break. I need to do Black Diablos and Gravios. How many hours? Well, it's not out yet. They just announced it the other day, Super Sorrow. But, I mean, I would imagine it's normal RPG link. I know I've got a Blaganga light bow gun. I forget what I made it for. Kezu? We're doing white Fatalis later. We're not doing white Fatalis tonight. There's a good water longsword I can make right now? Really? Is it upgradable or is it craftable? How do you know I can make it? How did you know? Aqua Guardian? Needs three Bazarios tiers. Just use bow? Bow I feel like is too limiting. Because I'm going to want to use it on the... Well, I guess I could use the light bow gun on the, on the other guys. Is that seriously rapid normal one? That's rapid normal one. So we already have a set for the for the the double black Diablos. How many hours? It's a normal RPG Super Sorrow, so I don't know. I mean, I expect like fifty hours. You could just take your long sword and hit it until it dies. But you see, I guess it's the old desert, so it's a little bit harder to lock things. <sighs> I 
Let's see what we get. Maybe we'll get gunpowder. All right, no, so we didn't. All right, all right, we'll, we'll, all right, we'll just try the Diablos normally. They have to have a ton of life though, right? They probably have like 10,000, oh, not 10,000, probably have like 5,000 life each, don't they? Can I carry you on Retro Jacula? I don't know which, is that the Retro Collection? I just hate the way the gameplay loop feels when I'm farming Diablos with a melee weapon. Because it's like, I guess I'll hit them in the ass. What am I going to do? I know. I'll hit them in the ass. But wait. How about I hit them in the ass? It's just like that for like an hour. Yeah, so nearly 5,000 health each. Fourteen's an MMO, but it's got a it's got a story to it. It's got a proper story to it. It's one of the DLC stages in Castlevania Harmony Despair. Oh, do you want me to like buy the DLC and then host it, or does everybody need to have it? Do I have pimples? Yes. Psycho serum. Yes. Traps. Okay. Tranks. Am I saying MMOs don't usually have stories? I mean, some of them don't do, some of them don't. I don't have tranks. If I don't have tranks, the traps are kind of pointless. We'll plan to capture one of them. I, I will make sure to grab it, Julian Carter. I don't know if I'll play it right away, because like I said, I'm playing um I'm playing Rune Factory 4. But maybe, I don't know, man. I, I really enjoyed that game back in the day. Play Sonic Adventure 2? I don't know that I ever played two. I played one a bunch. I played one and I even did like the chow farming stuff. Like I, I had the little VMU. Oh, you probably played it on the GameCube, come to think of it. Oh god, I do have flash bombs. Those are like shameful though. Play Sonic and Knuckles? Well, that's not Sonic Adventure 2. Can you pop out immediately? Oh. Guys, what do you see this thing's speed when it's enraged? It's crazy. It's actually a bad thing that I did that. What are those things I always throw to monster beginning to fight? Is that a weakener or something? So in games before Monster Hunter World, uh, you had to manually track the monsters. And you would do that generally by hitting them with a paintball. And then they show up as like a little pink dot on your map for about 10 minutes every time you hit them with a paintball. You do that so when they run away, you know where they went. Very 
in that case, balls? I mean, because inventory space was really limited in these older games, it added an extra element of you having to like plan out a hunt. And then if you like, you really got used to farming a monster, you would have a pretty good idea of always knowing where they went. And you, you would feel a little rewarded in that way. You'd feel a little satisfied. I just hit She goes into that ground like butter. But like, she already hit me with the teal tail once. What new game am I getting this year? I'm not really planning on buying any new games this year. I'm gonna get the new Final Fantasy game made by the Neo people next year. And we're just gonna play Monster Hunter Rise next year. Well, amongst other old Monster Hunter games. Is this Freedom Unite? It is. The food is so low. Yeah, that, you know, non-Monster Hunter related, that, that game is probably the one I'm looking forward to the most. The pixel remakes? Uh, I'll probably try out Final Fantasy VI. The issue with the pixel remakes, King, um, a lot of them have like, they, they took out whatever reason, like they dropped a bunch of stuff in some of them. Oh no, what do I drop? I'll drop these Psycho Serums. Like, you know, like all the extra content that was put into a lot of the games? Just gone. Gone. Not there. All the little bonus dungeons in the Game Boy Advance games? Not there. So, like, you know, why am I gonna rebuy and replay games with a bunch of, like, you know, remove stuff. The only one I would get is Final Fantasy VI because, like, I don't know, I've got a lot of nostalgia for that game. I just love how the biggest, like, meme game of E3 ended up actually being, like, genuinely one of the best games to come out or be announced this year. You're cleaning. Hello. But is it the morning over there, right? Ohio. Gozaimas. Did I say it right? Uh, Strangers in Paradise? I think they just called me bald? No, they were referring to you, Kinezis. Check the tag. You made chili tots tonight? Dude, like chili tot crew represent. You gonna have a sleepover at my house? A bunch of people wanted to go into my basement the other day. Not rise, he's a liar? We were streaming Rise earlier. Unironically, we were streaming Rise earlier. I'll say this. There's not a single, per well, there's not a single person in this stream who would, I hopefully rather be watching Rise than watching this game. We're going to the bed. I don't care. I'm going over. I'm going to be a bed boy. This is who I really am. 
I'm taking my mask off. I've always been a bed boy. How do I feel about KFC Taco Bells together? I don't have any near me, but that sounds like a great thing. I mean, it could be. Bed bug? Oh, those things are scary, though. I've seen one in real life, and they are, they are scary. Ad hoc party's dead. Do you just get, like, an error screen when you load it up? Oh, just no one's there? Oh, that feels bad. Hey, at least if the servers are up, though, that's still, like, there's a chance. Find World and Rise gameplay uninteresting to watch compared to old gen Monster Hunter? Uh, Rise gameplay is difficult to make uninteresting. World gameplay can be interesting. You just need to play it differently. <laughs> First apartment got bad bugs. So sad, man. You learned your coward stats from me? Do you go to the bed a lot? Wet dogs are great. Like, I don't want to use my Sonics when I don't have my spirit up. It doesn't feel like it's worth it. Oh, come on. I wish I could find out the origins for, like, the noise that it makes when you eat stuff. Like, the gooey noise. Because I kind of love it. Rage throwing your PSP when you lost to a Cantor? Oh, that's no good. You hope the DLC is good? Uh, I mean, I'm hoping it'll last longer than... The base game did. The base game was really fun for three months, and then nobody wanted to watch it again. I, my, my feeling is, is like, with mods, we can make Rise a more enjoyable game. You know, re rebalance potions and wirefall recovery, so you actually have to think a little bit before you use it. You're a zoner and a bed boy. And you blame me? Does a PC version of Gyro aim? I think it does. If it doesn't... You could always set it up in um, Steam. What the hell was that, by the way? I mean, I just think, get, get rid of, like, the insta-health. Volcano Burst, thank you. Super Sorrow, enjoy. Yeah, make, make Wirebug skills either nerf Wirebug recovery or make Wirebug moves more about utility than about overall DPS. I think both are viable. I don't know what would be more fun. I mean, it takes testing. Switch X really is, is kind of fine. I mean, there was the one guy in chat earlier that was like, I can't, I can't play Monster Hunter unless I'm always using the most optimal switch skills. And it just seemed like not fun. But like I have to play with Soaring Wyvern Blade. But it's like Invincible Gambit, so much more enjoyable. What if the new guys a grudge against Switch Axe? He might. It'll be interesting. I mean, it'll be really fun to see the new director's, like, you know, decisions. I have no idea what's going on. All right, hold on. Ah! <laughs> no!
I'm going to the bed. I'm being a bed boy. I don't have the healing to just heal through everything. I'm ashamed of it. I'm I'm more ashamed of it than you could ever imagine. Have I tried not getting hit? Have you seen this Diablos? If I was using light bow gun. She like tries to trick you out, man. Well, this is not bad boy level of health. No, we're not going to bed again. That's so lame. That's so lame. Add veg so we can make fun of my bed boy boys more effectively. Should have gone to bed. I still have another Diablos to go. Like literally a copy of this one. I'm not particularly optimistic. Crit boost secret also affected element. That'd be great. Literally combine crit boost and elemental boost, but maybe cut the boost that raw boost gives in half. It would still be, I don't know. I don't know if it would still be balanced. Here we go. Here we go. Texas Why are we back here? This is a required quest in G rank. Has there been any rage gunning yet? Oh yeah. Kezu and Gravios both got rage gunned. 
You like how you got tricked by Monster to Rise? The real sad thing is that you were you were thinking you were gonna try and find a, a somebody streaming Rise, and then you you got to the stream director. You're like, actually, I don't want to watch that. <laughs> actually, this is much better. I mean, Rise is still a good game. I, I don't want to dump on Rise. And the PC ran really well, and it was still, like, a ton of fun to play. And then mods will make it great. So. I don't know, guys. I got hit by that tail hitbox like three times? And she doesn't even have a tail. Just stop. This is double. Twenty minutes. How am I supposed to kill both of them? <laughs> I know it's so much life. Like, I want to go back to the bed again, but, like, at this point, like, I just need to be thinking about damage. I guess she was just like styling on my dead body. Nice way to join the stream. Thank you. Oh. Real nice. Yo. So we have the combat conga. That's a lot of raw damage on the desert tail. I don't know if I want to make it again, though. Nagakuga's, look Nagakuga's looking like it almost might be worth it. I need four fangs and two pelts.
guys. I might have brain damage. I mean, with Pierce, you just go through the body. Aiming for the tail. I mean, the conga, the conga is okay for Pierce, too, though. It's just like, Naga is like kind of a lot better. Let's um, let's unleash our frustrations on a Narga Kuga. Pellet, Pellet would be like ideal for him, but it wouldn't be ideal for Gravios. I don't even know what I should do for like. Do I even do anything about armor? <laughs> oh god. Yeah, no, this this quest is like the worst for like hammer. Diablos is not a good matchup, like at all. I'm gonna go in like mega cocky. Mine the big sword? I don't think I want to make anything from there. Earplugs? Not a bad idea, honestly. Oh, there's gunpowder. Even then, I don't, I don't know if we'd be able to beat the Gravios. I'd still rather just do Pierce. Had I beat Double Diablos the first time? Probably Pellet, Flash, Sonic, Trap, Spam. Double Nargakuga. That could be fun. Right? Because they'll be a lot weaker, too. These G-Rank Nargas? Yep. No, Narga's not that bad. If I had Evasion plus one or Evasion plus two, they would actually be like really easy. Just evade through everything, but as it is, they're still not bad. They're just not super, super easy. I mean, unless they both show up at the same time in the same area, that could be tough. Like, how bad could it be? Like, it can't be as bad as double Raja. It's a little one. Played this on your phone and got the G-Rank? Nice. forgot that his tail like really goes over. It's a little one. Uh-oh. Okay, they do both show up in the same way. That one's, one's, that one's tail went really far.
Come on, little guy. They are hurting each other. Like, they actually do decent damage to each other. for the little guy to run. <laughs> Alright, maybe I got a little cocky. Maybe... Maybe I got a little cocky. That's fine. I remember reading back in the day people saying monsters barely did damage to each other. I mean, people would, like, load up monsters in the arena and run around waiting for them to kill each other. So they definitely deal enough damage to kill each other eventually if they're just, like, in an arena bouncing on top of each other. No, no, this is... This is G-Rank. What? Oh, the little one got me. In general, monsters that attack like a ton would have an advantage over monsters that did stuff like Narga. Like Tigrex was was very good in the arena. So just constantly running. Kakubo or Rathalos bow and Freedom Unite. I really don't know. They probably have different shot types. I would assume Rathalos would be better, but... Making it interesting. It's not that bad. It's we're just just making it interesting. They really can't have that much light. He's still in rage. Get him, Texas. Wait, don't get him, Texas. I'd rather he not be enraged yet.
Is my defense maxed out? Sure. For what it is. I mean, we've got some high rank pieces mixed in here. Defense doesn't do much. Oddly enough. If he's walking and I'm walking out, I gotta sharpen. Should I play a new Metro yet? Nope. I'm sure it's a good game. But I've, I've got other things I've been playing, so. So we gotta play a little safe right now. Oh, Texas, did you just enrage the other one? Why would you do that? I'm leaving this up. Oh, God. Is this big man? That looks like the big one, right? Resisting the call of the bed. Now I want to go in the bed. and turn up. Oh, Super Sorrow. Same colors, turn up. Better card? Neither. I choose neither. I choose victory. Oh. Oh.
Oh. Symphony of the Night? Yeah, Symphony of the Night's a good game. He's got to be close, right? What, has it been almost 15 minutes? This is sad. What, the bed? The bed is not sad. The bed is what's going to allow us to win. Are these supplies coming? I've used this bed more in this playthrough than your entire career. <laughs> I've probably used it like a, like 50 times. If you don't get rise, you're going to be in trouble. No bed in Dauntless. I'm sure Dauntless has a lot more recovery items. Okay, and like we beat up the little guy like a tiny bit. But we still have psycho serums? No way. And cool drinks? Wait, what? You get four to six potions and then you're out? Well, easy game, easy life. Not to the baby. Which monster is this? This is Monster Hunter Freedom Unite. Pretty sure this was in somebody somebody said it was in GU. Do you think Cosmo, Henry, and Texas would hang out, Super Sorrow? Wait, are you saying Dauntless is more like classic Monster Hunter than Monster Hunter is, Mafudas? That is a bold claim. This map is not in GU. Oh, what the hell? Why did he angle it to the side? Uh! We'll never know what the micro one was. Well, I'm sorry I didn't get to show you the little one. I've got <laughs> no healing. I've got no nothing. What's weird is like he'd already begun the animation. Hammer? Hammer would actually be okay, but I'm gonna use the long sword. Yo.
I got one fang. I need three more. I'm going back into that quest. Now, we're trying to get a, a pierce weapon for the, um, we've got a Gravios we need to beat, and a Diablos. Back in here, use the bed. I didn't sleep enough in the quest. What's your favorite, my ca Castlevania? Ari of Sorrow. I love that game. I like collecting all the weird little souls. Not a coward. Oh yeah, we're absolutely rage gunning Diablos. I don't want to fight that normally. Are you kidding me? Maybe with maxed out G rank defense. Maybe. Still don't want to do it. Doesn't make it better. Bye. Definitely can't long sword Diablos. <laughs> I mean, I could. I just might. I might need to actually put like some defensive armor skills on. What's the one on the 3DS? There's two of them on the 3DS. There's uh, Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate and Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. They're both really good. I would be a Slime Soul. I don't remember what Slime Soul uh, skill was. Was that anything decent? rubber ball that bounces around. She sounds kind of fun. That tail goes really far. I feel like they nerfed his tail sweep in every like modern game. Is that just me who feels that way or? Is like objectively like much weaker in every other game. I actually heard the Nargakuga like flapping around. He's like, he's going in the next map. I'm proud of my herb usage. What the hell? Hello?
This sucks. I guess they just forgot to put a wall up there. God damn it. <laughs> well, well, hey, best boy. It's been a while. What's up? Flash pods? If ever there was a time to start abusing flash pods, this would be it. Yeah, I think you, you showed a screenshot of you having to, like, clip through the map in order to find the backflip monster. Call of the bed is here. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody gets at least one, one bed a quest. It's so much life. It's so much life to try and heal. Imagine if you could just carry a bed with you. What if it happens in the next Mod Center game? What if I use, what if I like, what if I gotta wean myself off the bed? It's like an addiction. I can only use it twice. I haven't sharpened yet. I'm amazed at how good of a job Razor Sharp does to keep this thing in purple sharpness. Get an Oreo mint milkshake? That sounds delicious. Mint is one of my favorite ice cream flavors. With infinite items, you may as well just give them the bed. Honestly, yeah, what if you had to like full on lay down and sleep? The, the Mega Vigor Wasp or whatever it's called. Yeah, he's basically like, a, I mean, he's definitely a full healer. Complains about IV drip. I mean, the difference is, is that in, in modern games, you do the IV drip and nobody shames you. In this game, like, you, when you go to the bed, like, you know you're pathetic. No, please! I bet you the other Narg is there. They're just waiting to hang out. Oh no. Okay, lucky. Do you think it's wasteful of me to always be eating like a well done steak whenever I only need to recover one thing of stamina?
not even mad because at least I'm not dead. You do it all the time? It's so gluttonous. I still don't know what like what I'm gonna do in this game to accelerate my farm. Cause I, I really do need like a lot of honey. Thank you a well done steak. I mean honestly they're gross though. <laughs> They're not good. A medium, a medium steak is perfectly fine. I mean, depending on the cut, it could be more or less tolerable if you make it well done. Does well done mean it was skillfully cooked? I mean, if it wasn't such a specific term it, within the context of steaks. Prime Gaper over here! Join the Gape Gang, Nuzcraft. Thank you. Thank you for the year. Medium rare is generally the best. Some cuts are, are maybe a bit better medium. If you like it rare, I'm sorry, but I've had rare before. Like, you're a bit of a psychopath. Maybe the hunters are just missing teeth. Says the man who kissed a goat. I would do it again too. I mean, tuna is different. I mean, tuna is like sushi. Oh, oh, oh. Somebody like their steaks extra rare. I mean, I've had like a rare steak before. You know, a rare steak, for those of you who don't know, cold blue center, you know. I don't mean like pink. I don't mean red. Like blue. just like it's like the texture is not something you're used to eating that's more than anything yeah you should cook your food at least medium rare warm red center is a whole hell of a lot better than a cool blue one. Just kill the bacteria off. Oh, there's there could be bacteria inside you though. Come on, Narga. 
that was a mistake. I just love that squishy noise when you eat things. It might be one of the things I miss the most. That aspect of the sound design. Why did I do that? Drink cold coffee every morning? I mean, I get that. Oh no, too, way too early. Well done, is the kid's meal of a steak? Some people won't even eat steak though. What, if that's the kid's meal of steaks, like what is chili cheese tater tots? Delicious. They are good. Steak itself isn't that good. I mean, it depends on the cut. But yes, I mean, you gotta season that stuff. Well, the best Incognito Man is like when they completely ruin the outside. So the outside is just beyond charred and the inside is still not cooked. That, that's messed up. I got robbed just now. Please, did there, is there healing here yet? Give me my stuff, man. You get paid out on triples, Alex. Should have gone to bed. I'm not going to run from the top of the zone down to the bed to heal. You guys would never... I mean, I'm already going to the bed enough as it is, and you guys are already giving me a hard time. <laughs> you will, though. I've got four potions. That might be enough. Got this? Thank you. Oh. Is that more than half my way? We're gonna we're gonna wait for that red health to come back a little bit. Don't hit me with your phone. I didn't mean to, I actually did not mean to zone. I'm not going to do anything because I was not intending to do that. I'm getting better at evading the head, the roar. I might uh, go to bed in real life. Oh, I was up until like 5 or 6 a.m. today, yesterday, Fume, playing Rune Factory, so I'm a little sleepy. <laughs> That's not going to be a marathon screen. Don't kill me like that. Don't do me like that, Nardo. His, 
kill really stretches. Yeah, I was up, I was up way too late. I like at the time I'm like, oh, that's not good. You know, it with that in mind, like the the rise performance was actually really good. No. You're not going to attack me from there. Yeah, PC demo is uncapped if you want it to be. That was a hard one. I don't know why I was struggling so bad against just Nagakuga, but I mean, he is G rank, I guess, right? We just got another Heavenly, by the way. That's two. Oh. Yeah. That's two. Good job. Thank you, Super Smash. I don't know if I have the ass here. I actually don't remember what the original sounded like either, Incognito Man. That's actually kind of funny. Will the Rise demo have the same DRM that the real release will have? Well, assume it's going to have some form of de novo. Just assume that and you will not be disappointed. Thanks for the stones. I don't know if I got enough fangs out of that. Oddly enough. It might even tell you the exact version of Denova it'll have too. I think we might need some high rank ones. Maybe. Um, the demo runs so well, Nami Tori. I'm not going to be too worried about DRM slowing it down. Like, I don't want to sound like an apologist or anything, but... It runs pretty good. Still, I need two more heavy things. All right. Have some tea in the morning? I usually have coffee. Although, I'm thinking of going on, like, a little detox of coffee. Because it really doesn't do anything for me anymore. So I got to stop drinking it for like a week or two so I can like go back to enjoying the benefits of it. You know what DRM is or does? It's supposed to make it harder to pirate the game. But then the first thing that the pirates do is take the game and then they remove it. <laughs> it's supposed to reduce people's theft, but I don't know how well or often that works. You think it doesn't do anything that stops drinking it? Well, it doesn't do as much as it used to. Tea? Just drink tea instead? It's still got caffeine. I guess it's got less caffeine. Did I just do double mushroom? God damn it. Doesn't matter. We're, we're doing a baby. What is a demo of DRM? Well, I don't know if the demo's got DRM. Assassin of the Swamp. Come on, buddy. I mean, I like tea. I, I've got some tea. What do I got around here? I got some, like, ginger tea. That's pretty tasty. I get that at Adong. Adong Grocery Store. Its name is literally Adong. It makes me laugh every time I go. You make tea out of ginger? No. Ginger tea with honey. It's delicious. 
I mean, I like coffee. I just like, I want it to, I just want to feel something. Share the tea with you? I mean, it's pretty common. You probably have some in your, in your cabinet. The, the thing that I like about tea is like obviously more so than coffee. Like you can get kind of crazy with the flavors. Coffee, no matter what you're gonna do, compared to tea, it's, it's coffee. I mean, you can definitely taste the difference between good coffee and bad coffee. I'm not saying that, I'm just saying. Tea? Tea gets weird, man. Tea goes to strange places. Take chat to Adong. They've got some nice, um, like, Chinatown-style, like, pastries there. It's not, like, full Chinatown. Like, full Chinatown's got a lot of great stuff. But it's, it's okay. Your family doesn't drink tea anymore after I gave your mother two kidney stones? Well, how much tea was she drinking? I mean, I'm not blaming her, but... Was she, like, pounding, like, a, a pitcher a day of... Of tea? Well, it is weird fighting this... Narga here. Look at him standing. He thinks he's people. Yeah, like coffee is like blueberries. Like maybe if you added like blueberry syrup. You know? Maybe. Now a tea, you can make a tea taste like blueberries if you really wanted. So he's in that zone. Come over here, little buddy. Come on. There we go. Did I ever learn tea making? I don't know that I like tea enough to do it. The only reason I'm talking about tea is because a superstar wants me to have some. I'm not like a passionate tea lover. Almost gone. Oof. Crab, no! Oh my god, that crab hit actually pretty hard. I could die to a crab right now. I don't want to die to a crab. Leave me alone! What, uh, what happened after you had two mega monsters back to back? Were you having like weird heart issues? Or were you just like actually just like tweaking out? The thing is, is like with energy drinks, especially like they work so much better than coffee, but like it feels like they have such a like a stronger like after effect. Like you gotta like recover from those things. These crabs are actually making this game harder. Would I try the Civic Coffee? Only if I could be guaranteed that it was from wild, happy cats that ate the beans out of their own choice. This is an industry of people out there taking the cats it's not funny. It's actually, it's really sad. They take the cats, they stuff them in cages, and they just keep feeding them the beans. 
And rather than it being a happy thing that these weird tree cats do, they're just sitting there like eating, eating and pooping out beans all day. And that's terrible. You know? Like, what, would I be curious to taste how it tasted? I guess. But not, it wouldn't be worth it to actually like support in any way what could be like a bad, bad thing like that, you know? Tried that copy, didn't care for it? I mean, I'm sure it's got some sort of weird flavor going on. For people, for some dude to be like, yo, I gotta roast this thing that came out of this cat's ass. You know, for somebody to say that, like, I don't know, maybe it's a weird bean, who knows? You drank two forbidden Jeff Gordon energy drinks? I have no idea what those are. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna try and do cold turkey one of these days, just, just for two weeks. Just a, just a mini, mini caffeine detox. Like Jeff Gordon, like, is the NASCAR? Is Jeff Gordon a NASCAR guy? I don't, I don't know if I'm Kakona enough to, to get this reference. Oh, Procal, I worked in college. Like I did research with a guy that was getting into the chocolate industry. It's real bad. One of those unfortunate realities of globalization and people wanting the cheapest cost for everything which I mean you guess you can't blame them got it gotta eat so in chocolate industry use actual slaves that's what they were the research of the guy I was working with so I'll tell you what happened He's actually, uh, I mean, this is sad. He's actually dead now, so I'm not, I'm not too worried about talking about it. The only person that could possibly get, get hurt, I guess would be me. We meet up at a cafe, ironically, cafe, talking about coffee, and this other stuff. And we sit down for our first in-person meeting. And I forget if I had like a phone or a recorder. And like he was cool, but he's like, hey, that's not on, is it? I'm like, I'm like, should I should I not turn it on? He's like, I don't want there being any recordings on this. People out there may want me dead. I'm not joking, this really happened. And what he was doing research on was the use of like, you know, large American food companies, I won't say who, in the uh, the Ivory Coast, you know, not only potentially using act like slave labor, like potentially child slave labor, in in the acquirement of their of their food, of their of their chocolate and stuff. And I I did a lot of research for them. I I really did. Um, it was for an internship. And um, when I went to finish the internship, the guy like just like dropped off of existence, which is fine. Like I didn't need, it was like one, the final three credits for me to get like an extra minor. how do he pass? I think it was actually just like cancer or something like, you know, a normal human disease. He wasn't taken out by like elite, like chocolate industry snipers. How do I know? I don't I don't know for sure. But I mean who knows? I mean, you know, there's uh there's little there's little things out there like polonium and stuff that they could easily slip into you if they really wanted that will that will get you dead. Just means the chocolate snipers did their jobs, right? The fact that it's debatable, right? Out of all the people I met 
when I was doing research into stuff like that, he was like the only real one. Because like he was the only one that cared. Like there's so many people that get involved in like humanitarian things like that that just want to do it because like they want to sniff their own farts and feel cool about themselves. Like they don't they don't actually want to do anything or care at all. So that guy was great. I like that guy. He will be missed. He was a, definitely a, a good person. Oops. Yeah, I mean, at this point, though, Papaya Apple, like, if you want to eat any food by that... The one you're talking about, that food company, like, what are you going to do? <laughs> you know? Like, you can't... It's just like if you didn't like Amazon or whatever... Really? Boycott it? What, to own yourself? <laughs> I'll punish myself. You know? So, it's a shame. You know, all you can hope is that, you know, people are like, hey, I'll be willing to spend an extra 20 cents so a literal child doesn't have to, like, harvest my cocoa beans. Dude, inflation's intense, man. I left the grocery store yesterday and I only spent $60 and I'm like, wow, that was a cheap trip to the grocery store. But is it though? Is it really? Maybe for a 30-60-60. Funny, good. That's cheap. That did get me the ingredients for chili cheese tater tots. I did get a whole hell of a lot of cottage cheese. I got like six... Six uh, containers of that. Impossible unless you don't get much. What did I get? Eggs, chili cheese tater tots, uh, pasta and sausage, cottage cheese, not much else. No beans. I, I have. So, I have. A, I've got a pretty good stock of beans, and they weren't on sale. What? No, Genpre, why? Texas, get me up. Whoa. How does the inflation come down besides us not buying food to eat? Uh, I mean, efficiencies of scale can efficient, uh, eventually bring down the cost of things. And if people just stop spending money, that can be a deflationary pressure. Start burning money? You could remove money from circulation. And and the Federal Reserve can technically do that in, in various ways. Ultimately, you just hope that your employer or however you make money is able to keep pace with pay raises to compensate for inflation. I think they said they're putting like a 6% cost of living increase for Social Security. Which, I mean, if that's what they're putting in for Social Security, I mean, it's at least 6%, if not more. I mean, I know that's, like, a joke. What I just said is, like, comedy.
Does money ever make sense past the degrees and years of scientific analysis? No, the most important thing I learned about money is it's all made up. It's not real. Am I farming something? Yeah. Fangs. Hey, defense high. I'm the one that's getting farmed. Well, hold on. To be fair, this stream, we did we did technically upgrade our longsword, right? So it's not like it's been a complete bust. What's the most baby tier monster in G rank that gives high grade earplugs? Oh, Jesus Christ. Kuk Does Kaku actually give earplugs? Are you kidding me? I really don't want to fight Azure. I'm finding him here. We're going to this. We're doing this one. You don't think Kaku has ever given earplugs? There might have been one weird game where he gives earplugs. It's not impossible. I mean, I could bring... I could bring the combines for 15 flash bombs and have like... 20 sonic bombs and then be naked. Think you had to confuse the Garuga? Oh, that's reasonable. What did Texas just do to this cut? It's a well-timed Sonic. Job text. Red Kezu? I would almost rather fight almost anything else than Red Kezu. Will I be getting a raise? Not with gameplay like this. What was the first console to handhold to have a sleep mode function? The PSP is the first handheld I remember having it. I mean, maybe we would fight, farm, like, high, high rank camellios. I don't know. I'll, I'll look after the stream. Ah! 
The smartest thing to do is, is literally just Omega abuse flashes in Sonics. Just call it a day. If we do that, we could maybe even just do it with Longsword. And if we got to farm Velocidrome anyways, for Screamers, we could actually get Honey. We will do that tomorrow. It's just that black, black Diablos was so bad. And like, it was only one of them. It wasn't even two of them. a tough time tonight guys we're having a tough time tonight. <laughs> we're not doing so good I'm not abandoning I believe do I have trinks Somehow, Feline Defender is still working. I guess that's right. Food skills last between carts. I'm trying my best. Am I? Am I really? Am I really giving it my best? Could I be doing more? Sorry, I guess I just wrung myself out like a dish rag on day stream. And you guys just have like the crumpled up <laughs> moist rag of night stream shepherd. At least we have a rag, it's true. Any form is a good form? I'm here. Day streams are gonna be like, you did what? Wait, didn't we beat? We beat Gold Rathi in this stream, right? We did stuff. It hasn't been that bad. It hasn't been all misery. That rod, no, the rajang at 100% count. Good. <laughs> there, can there, is there a term for when you heal in old school monster hunters? All right, hold on, hear this out. You heal from taking an attack, and then you end up with the exact same amount of health because in the process of healing, you got hit by the same attack that you took in the first place. 
Is there a term for that? There is? What is that term? Zero sum discharge. No, I know you guys know what I'm talking about. I like that there's an actual thing. It's a shame that you can't do it anymore, really. Hasmodic equilibrium? Bedtime? That's not what that is. Isn't it messed up that you break Narga's eye? I think that's kind of messed up. Hello? Just took off like a, like a superhero. What it... Do you remember like a very rough translation of what it might have been, Fume. Oh, I guess we should go up and then around. How would I have done this quest? I would have done this quest with Greatsword, right? With the Nargakuga Greatsword. If you if you knew what your uh, what a rough translation was. I guess you would have posted it if you did. That didn't, um, that didn't instant enrage him. Disrespect Nibble. Oh, you're so close. seeing like an online hunt of Rajang and it was very interesting because there was four people and they had a series of pitfall traps and the Rajang kept getting enraged and popping out of the trap and he would like just backflip into another one it was like dominoes kind of 
Needless to say, he was dead within like 40 seconds. Remember that flam? They were doing like status gunning on him too. He just kept popping out from one uh, one trap to another. Is multiplayer have scaling? Depends on the game. Most games do not have actual scaling. The monsters are just stronger. World was the first game to have like actual scaling. Well, he wasn't limping. He can't be that weak. It's weird that we've all seen this really old, really crusty video. I mean, the quality on it wasn't great, but the the placement of seeing the Rajang ping pong around between pitfalls was very satisfying. Yeah, but like, I remember watching it like years ago. But then again, I guess if you're watching Monster Hunter videos, there's a lot of Monster Hunter videos now. There's probably a lot less in the olden days. Can you send me crappy mo romance mangas that are also lewd? Yeah. You can and should send me them. I'm into that. There had, well, hold on, hold on. There's gotta be drama. I'm not just looking for booby manga. If there happens to be booby, that's fun. What the hell, he just died. Big, oh my god, you kissed who? You did what? No, don't don't say success yet. We we still don't have our fangs. Do I like shouju manga? You actually beat a monster. Stop. I don't know what shouju is. Is that like shonen? Marketed to a female audience between the ages of 10 and 18. Well, I'm not a female age 10 to 18. Candy Candy, Card Captor Sakura. Uh, pretty, I mean, I, I've never, I've not read any of these. I'm looking for one that I've re read. I, I don't know any of these. Sailor Moon, I know Sailor Moon. You're not a male age 10 to 18 either? What, are you, what the hell are you trying to say? It's two things. Shoju Manwa is pretty good. The last maybe Shoju Manwa I read was can't, can't see, can't hear, but love. And it was about a deaf woman who becomes romantically involved with a blind man. And the man was also a manga artist, so it becomes very difficult for him to do his job because he is blind. I don't know why I laugh. It's not funny. I feel bad for the guy.
That's pretty good. We got finally exactly what we needed. I need to figure out what armor I need. Definitely gonna farm up some... Screamers, I guess. I don't really know what else to do. Let's take a look at the armor. Let's look at the baby armor. The baby G-rank gunner armor. Yo. That's evade there. Evade wouldn't be bad. Make crab set? Crab would work. Such a cheap game. <laughs> it's not giving me any choices. God, it's, it's so hard to make things. I'm just trying to think of, like, if I'm gunning Diablos, if I'm gunning Diablos with high rank armor, like, how is that going to go? G rank black Diablos. I mean, you can take three hits. Right? Uh, you take three hits, and then it's over. That's scary. What do we need for, like, evade decos? Or earplug? Oh, I gotta do... Oh, that's not good. So scary. I'm scared. Can I just make chakra? Chakra? It doesn't really have a lot of defense, does it? Oh, I guess because you could probably wear it on anything. If you can take two hits, you're immortal with the power of bed. <laughs> All right, we're just going to do a quick test. We're just going to see what happens. <laughs> we're just going to see what happens. We're gonna, it's not, this isn't, this is not, this is a purely, this is a reconnaissance mission. Oh, you know what's about to happen. No, this run is not going to count. Oh no, oh no, this is guaranteed. Well, maybe not. Hold on. No, it's the, the question is, is it a one-shot win in Rage? I mean, obviously it is, right? I mean, obviously it is. All right, here's, here's the bet. We'll make a bet. The bet is going to be one shot 
not enraged. Okay. Where is it? Well, I gotta find start. Start a prediction. There we go. So it was full life. How much defense do I have? 205. A charge. A, a, a normal charge. It's like, you know, a, 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 a roar or, or no roar. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Just a, just a charge. No funny business. You don't get the bet. The bet. The bet is, is will I get one shot by like literally just like a normal charge? Or not? Things are still so expensive in this game. Four-man demo manga is dual blades? Congratulations, it is not easy. Hi. And then we're gonna test it enraged as well. Jason, hello. You that many people think we're gonna survive? Alright. You have no idea what's going on? It's a question of survival. Uh, we survived! Not bad either! But that is very doable with gunner armor. All right, now, um, now for the real test. Give me your one channel point. Oh, we're gonna pay out the believers. I'm just, I'm just finding out. I wonder what this gun of attack up ends up being better than um, affinity because of the high base affinity, anyways. Probably. Condor, how have you been? I feel like Condor, you must be almost exclusively VOD squad. Your hours are so goblin. We survived that. 
Almost the same damage. Almost exactly the same damage as an unenraged charge. It's like we may not need to farm up armor at all. Oh, we don't have we don't have any max potions. Okay. It's actually really funny. To me, that's funny. Talking about something really funny. Got a little uh, thing we gotta show off. When did Guts get added to Monster Hunter? Oh, it's definitely in this game. Dose, maybe? Um, I don't show off my disc plates, but I don't know where I put them. Um, How am I? I'm okay. I've got Alzheimer's, apparently. <laughs> Hold on. I'll be back in one minute. to a recent sponsor, Displate. Displate, making high quality metal posters. You know those things you got up on the wall? Those crinkly, stained, folded out stuff laying around? Not these, high quality metal posters. Excellent art there. Pretty good there. Not just a poster company for, for every displate sold. They help contribute money to grow a tree. I know the last time we talked about this, somebody said, what type of tree? I still have not found out yet. <laughs> What's my favorite monster from Monster Hunter? Nergigante. Show the booba one. Well, it is uh, my pleasure to tell you, Papaya Apple, that at this plate, they have a large selection of high quality art, be it Booba or not Booba. I got some anime boys down in my basement. And if I wanted, you know, I could just switch them around. You know, it's, it's metal. And so the mounting things has like a little metal bracket. Just switch them around whenever you want. Well, they've been supporting the stream for a little while now. See it popping up there. Can I perforate those massive milkers? Oh, excuse me? No, no, no. The anime boys are down in my basement. These things, like, I want to hang up behind me. Maybe I will hang them up behind the green screen. But it feels weird to hang it up behind something. So I just have them out here right now. So, um, click that link. There is a discount code to the GG Talent Group, which... I guess it was announced today that they are switching over to Turbopium. <laughs> Tur 
Terpopium? Terpopium. In any case, the, the discount code is still good. So, uh, you know, there's there's some Monster Hunter stuff on there. Not the Monster Hunter stuff that I love yet. We might get some of our own our own art up there soon. Terpopium. Not Turbocopium. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're nice. So if, you, if you're looking to decorate, if you just got a bunch of blank walls, and you're like, man, I'd like to get some stuff up on the wall. You know, it doesn't take that many. I only have two down in the basement. And uh, it looks nice. So check it out. Again, discount there. High quality metal posters. Thank you. Thank you, display. GG Talent Group is the better name? Um, I like GG Talent Group. Why haven't I hung the posters up yet? All right, so hold on. Are we going to get Maldi posters? I might try and put a Maldi poster up. I just, I need to clean them up because like, I don't, the resolution that it needs to be is pretty high. So you can't just like take like a tiny JPEG or whatever and throw it up. Unless that's what you want. Unless you want the full quality metal like crust. So what we could do, and this is so shameful, is like rotate back and forth between the two Black Diablos. And when one gets enraged, like scuttle back like a coward to then fight the unenraged one. You might buy Maldi posters and your parents might ask you what the hell Maldi is? I think it's pretty understandable what Maldi is. Don't they enrage at one hit? You're right. At a certain point, they do enrage at one hit. That will not work. Well, we'll just have to not die then. You can see how that's any different than what I normally do. Very funny. What happens if they're both mad? You just flash them. <laughs> what happens if they both enrage? Guess you try to drag them towards each other. Where is this Velocidrome? Maybe he's in seven. I should have put my auto tracker set on. You have nothing but love for me? Well, that's nice of you. Thank you. Does monster get HP regen and the hunter's not around? They only regenerate health if they're in their den sleeping. But they can, I believe, sleep enough to get outside of capturable range. Sweet! <laughs> nice! If there's a better way to get screamers, can you buy them from the granny? think so I'm trying to remember if like back in the day this is what I would do to get screamers 
I mean, I guess you could fight, like, Kutku. But I feel like this is faster. I mean, that was two hits. That's a good amount, actually. That's eight. We need, like, what, 20? That's a good amount of screamers. That's, that's what we're looking for. Did no one's doing speed runs today. We did some challenge runs. We did two demo clears. I don't know. This, so like, I didn't, I didn't love Dose. Because a lot of like the hunter lifestyle things just felt like annoying. And like they wanted to punch you in the balls. But, um, this aspect I don't mind. You take flash bombs over Sonics? Why not both? Will Diablo's dig with Sonics or flashes? 1445 hammer RTA beat that? Oh, is that like... That's the same time I did, just like without rides. Good job. I guess no monster rides, no... Uh, Wait, no, you didn't say TA, you just said RTA. That was me? Oh, I see. I mean, for first try, that's okay. Remember you used to do Sonic Flash combo on Diablos? I mean, after the Sonic, right, there's a moment where they're flying in the air and you can dunk them. Not that it really helps that much, but it is fun. Do I have the inventory space for bombs? I feel like the damage from my weapons are going to outpace the damage I would get from bombs. Do you know what I mean? Like, so 10 large bell bomb pluses is like, what, 1500 damage? Which is a lot, but, like, how quickly can I do 150 damage with, like, the Norga light bow gun? I mean, the real thing is, like, you gotta get through 10,000 life on two monsters that, when in rage, can one-hit you. Oh, this one doesn't give any. Huh? If I had to be a moss wine or a slag toth, which one would I choose? The moss wines seem much happier. And it doesn't seem like anything like really preys on the moss wine, where many things seem to prey on the slag toth. So I like I like mushrooms. Like I could I could chill with some mushrooms all day long. Also, that high rank armor I had was not upgraded. Mosswine avatars. And I don't know about that. But they seem pretty happy. I mean, occasionally they do attack. Yeah, Slytoth just stands out and like, what does he even do? Just like... Scans around. Drones. I mean, and look at... Look how thick they are, too. I mean, yeah, you're a pig, but, like, you're thick.
Was it Noxella? Was it you? Were you in the stream when I think it was like Socks or somebody came on when I was playing one of the Resident Evil games and we were closely examining the liquor's like body to see if it had a butthole? Do you think that's why I don't get early access? That's got to be part of it, right? Sounds familiar. It may have happened more than once. Spinal fluid thing? I mean, I, I feel like Socks and I still get along. Did I ask for early access? Apparently you gotta really grovel, Oz. They gave it. They gave it after we groveled. Gilan, why did he leave Capcom? Do you think I'm part of the reason why? Do you think he like was afraid? Did Yuri ever forgive me for not playing with him? Yuri never asked me to play with him. What do you mean? If Yuri wanted to play, I'd play. I'd play with Yuri right now. I would drop everything and I'd do Rise with him. 100% would. I'm not part of the reason why. I am the reason why. I'm not even in you. I've got nothing to do with him. On the Apple Arcade game. Are you talking about Yuri or Socks? That was Yuri who asked me about the Apple Arcade game. That wasn't Socks. I remember always being impressed at how high you had to climb to get up here. Hmm. You guy knows the truth. I'm gonna be so nice. Hmm. Well, the drum is really cooperating at the very least. Invite him on stream? All right, I will. I will. I'll message him tomorrow. I'll be like, hey man, just want to know if you want to join me on stream sometime and we can try and take down Magnum Moldo. And we can introduce you to the community. They can learn more about you. He might like that. I will say this, Turbopium, Turbocopium is based in the EU. What do you mean he knows who I am? Basically already. In. Well, I mean, he could always be like, no. <laughs> He'd just be like, no, I'm not doing that, I'm busy. Noxel, I have no idea. I did not come up with it. I don't know. You met Yuri at PAX East when they're showcasing for you. I was there too. You must have been really young. Moss Wines have new predators. I am the predator. Once I am the Moss Swine, they're safe for life. How many screamers do you think that is? I might have some Sonic Bombs left. Is Magnum Aldo as hard in the full game as even the demo? Not even close. The demo is very special. 
with the challenge that Magnum Allo presents. You will be very disappointed if you assume he will be that strong. I mean, you wouldn't be wrong for thinking he would be that strong, but... like a million screamers. Can we get a display to Molly? Everybody wants a display to I'm telling you, man, I'm like, Yo. this is not 100% me. What does normal Gypseros have? Probably nothing good. He's like, what you heard about Demo Energy Gigante? Demo Energy Gigante is nowhere close to Demo Moldo. Those are, those are different, much different scales. Like, maybe the Kakus would give okay armor? So, I never did the demo of Elkana because I was trying to, like, stay crunchy for that one. Fume, you've done both, then. Which one is harder? Too hard for me. I never had a, you don't know that. We never had a chance to try it. I just wanted my first time to be special, Joker Kun. You you understand. Is Maldo as hard as people saying? You should download the demo in case they ever delist it. Just so you can have it and try it yourself. It's, it's a couple of things, but it's really the, the time is so brutal. If they gave you another five minutes, no problem. Easy quest. Some of Maldo's moves are kind of weird, though. Some really sad noises for me, guys. I don't know. I would. It depends on the weapon. Comparing 
comparing Maldo to Behemoth, I feel like Behemoth isn't that bad once you get his gimmicks. Even once you know Maldo's gimmicks, you're still going to be coming up to the 15-minute mark pretty regularly. And then if you want to try and do it, like, without rides, like, it's then, it's like a whole other layer harder. Extremeth can be a lot worse because managing like managing Carbidus is, is a bit of a pain. Why doesn't it notice him cutting? It's the Sigma grind set. moves can still sometimes be like kind of funky because like it's not consistent ligma mindset very funny like when you do like a like a counter wire bug move for one weapon it could be way different from weapon class to weapon class some give you forever some are like oh you got you know two frames enjoy it Set. I mean, especially within like with how much damage he does, you know, when everything is anywhere between a, a one shot and a two shot from him, it, it changes things. I think there's a common reason why both Kutku and Rathos first subspecies are blue. No. Probably somebody just likes the color blue. The, the dish is the only for somebody who's got like 500 hours of rise my only issue with wire bugs really is saving yourself ends up being too easy of a thing to do and two the wire bug moves sometimes really take away from your, like, your normal move set with some balancing I think they could be fun but Dr. Ray have a good night Couple cuckoo pieces. You're excited to see modders make monster versus monster videos for Rise? There's actually a YouTube channel out there that's basically 100% making videos of monsters versus monsters in Iceborne. Puts their health bars up. It, it sounds more interesting than it ends up being, but it is kind of funny to see their full movesets and how much damage they actually do to each other. What's left of this game? Double Black uh, Diablos. And G rank. Gravios and G rank. 
the final urgent in G rank. The Fatalises, Kieran, King Shakalaka. Not too much, we're getting there. Yeah, I mean, Maldo just, like, hits you with his whole body. Like, Velcon is, like, you know, telegraphing where her tail is going to go, and it goes exactly where it looks like it should go. Maldo just flings his whole head at you. I mean, we just got a really, really good Pierce gun. We have to kill Ashenwell. See what these sets give. There's got to be like a Kaku mixed set we can make for G rank. Yo. Recovery speed, attack. I mean, that's fine. Like, attack is fine. Expert. So you have minus health, you have minus defense. So like we could we can make some mix. We might even be able to get like attack up large critical I plus three. Something like that. Oh, I, I'm planning on gunning Bravios. There's no way. There's no way fighting him normally. I'm gonna have to make a spreadsheet for this. Looks like G rank Kutku is mostly psychic vision. Like the blue one is much better. Like, old Camellia's theme more than Rise Camellia's theme? I'm not sure. I'd have to listen to them, like, side by side. Really decide which one I like better. I can't even make either of their legs. Alright. I'm gonna figure this out tomorrow. Like I said, late night playing Rune Factory last night. Not going to do that again tonight. Um, but we should have... We should, we should finish G-Rank tomorrow. I say that optimistically, but we should finish G-Rank tomorrow because we only have three quests to go. And then it's a matter of cleaning up and then getting the gear ready for the Fatalis. Which will probably take, will probably kill Black Fatalis Saturday, or at least unlock Black Fatalis on Saturday. No, I'm not going to play Rune Factory for hours after stream. I'm not going to do that. Maybe one hour. Kick Fatalis to death like you did a Cantor. It would take 18,000 kicks. If you got four people, once Fatal White Fatalis was out of armor mode, you can might might actually be able to do it. Um, all right, thank you everyone. I love you. See you tomorrow. Goodbye.